हेलो एंड वेलकम एवरी वन आई एम पुष्पक पंडित एंड यू आर वॉचिंग मी ऑन माई यूट्यूब चैनल बींग बुकेश सो दिस इज द सिक्स वीडियो ऑफ आई सी एस सी टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन सीरीज विच आई एम मेकिंग ओके एंड दिस वीडियो इज बेस्ड अपॉन केमिस्ट्री चैप्टर फोर विच इज एनालिटिकल केमिस्ट्री बट बिफोर आई बिगिन लेट मी टेल यू अबाउट माई फर्स्ट फाइव वीडियोज so that if there is anyone who is new to the channel he can know that what are the videos which have been already covered talking about out of the five videos the first three videos means the three videos are for chemistry chapters chemistry chapter 1 chapter 2 and chemistry chapter 3 all the important portion of the of all those chapters have been already covered now the two videos are for computer application subjects the first part of computer application means part 1 was based upon class 9th syllabus class 9th syllabus and i have covered all chapters and taking out the most important theoretical question of each chapter okay now the part 2 was based upon class 10th syllabus and i have provided you all the important question of each chapter of class 10 the important theoretical question now one more important thing that i don't only provide you the important theoretical question which i think and give you no basically what i do is take out the previous year question and match that question that means i tell you that this question has been, has came in some of the other years and i give you the real proof the icsc previous year proof so that you can definitely rely and have faith upon my questions which i give you okay now talking about this video means analytical chemistry important question then one thing which i will tell you in the first thing is that this is a very easy chapter easy chapter in the sense that you don't get much variety in the question from this chapter there are only two types of question for, uh, which you get from this chapter okay the first type is that color and the second type is equation you already know and if you know don't know then look in the book that you have been given two columns in which there are some salts like calcium uh, lead which reacts with sodium hydroxide and the same salts react with ammonium hydroxide and you get respective color means if calcium nitrate or other salts react with uh, sodium hydroxide then you get some different color while it gives different color when it reacts with ammonium hydroxide so basically you need to learn all those color specifically okay whatever is the color you have been given learn that exactly means if the color is light green learn it light green not just green because that is the thing where you can lose your marks okay now i am going to give you small little little question because there are not much variety but still i would provide you some question and uh, i will also show you that how you can answer those question okay so watch the video till the end okay now let me start the video okay so one more thing which uh, i need to tell you is that do the reactions of amphoteric oxides and hydroxides also which you have been given in the book so do the column and uh, the one is amphoteric hydroxides and oxides equations which you have been provided so do all of them now let me start with the different different question types the first question type is the simple question types which comes in the, this question okay you can clearly see that one there is one question for which you have been provided with four options the question is that the salt solution which does not react with ammonium hydroxide so if you know and if you have done all that column which i have provided you which i have told you then you can definitely answer this type of question and you can get the question like what color will you get if this reacts with this from this chapter okay this is an icsc 2018 question now this is another question from icsc 2018 paper and i will recommend you to do this type of question because this is the most famous and most common type of question which is asked from this chapter see the question give a chemical test to distinguish between the following pair of chemical 
lead nitrate solution and zinc nitrate solution i will also show you the answer for this but first let me read the question the second question is that sodium chloride solution and sodium nitrate solution so how can you distinguish between sodium chloride and sodium nitrate okay so let me see the answer here see the answer the first question answer is that by adding ammonium hydroxide in excess light lead nitrate solution gives a white precipitate while zinc nitrate solution gives a colorless solution so basically you have written a color name for this question which is what i wanted to tell you the color name is very important in this chapter okay if you are thorough with the colors then you can differentiate between any of the compounds which you will provided in the question see the second answer question by adding silver nitrate or lead nitrate solution sodium chloride gives a white precipitate while sodium nitrate gives no precipitate or colorless solution or remains unchanged alternate correct chemical test all of them are accepted okay so basically you can see that the color name is provided for the question and what this is what you will be needed to write in your answer sheet if you write something else then i don't think you will get any marks now this is the another type of question which i have already told you the equation type of question so don't expect only color uh, color type of question but also expect some equation types of question from this chapter see question number 4 Ammonium hydroxide is added to ferrous sulfate solution. This question was specifically asked in the year 2019. So you can see here that uh, equation has been asked from this chapter. So don't only prepare the color name, but also prepare and have a practice through all the equations given in this chapter because they are all very important. Now. This is again a 2019 question. See question number two. The question is distinguish between the following pairs of compounds using the reagent given in the bracket. So basically, what you need to do here is that you need to distinguish that is given, but you need to distinguish between what is given here. Let me read the question first. That ferrous sulfate solution and ferric sulfate solution. So you need to differentiate between these two, but using sodium hydroxide only. If you'll consider ammonium hydroxide, then you won't be given any marks. So on the basis of sodium hydroxide, you need to give a difference between them. So friends, that's all from this video. I know the question were short, but believe me that these are the only types of question which you can expect from this chapter. Okay, so best of luck. Prepare well, and I will meet you in the next video. Thank you.